Hi, it's Chris here on a fine, fine Tuesday morning. Dinner time, time it is now. <laughs> uh, I'm at the. I've just walked down from Rudyard on the feeder for the canal for the Calden Canal. It's a bit sludge. It's taking me about an hour. I'm parked up at Rudyard and I've walked down. Uh, the last video I did where it le actually left the Rudyard Reservoir. Hello. Rudyard Reservoir is actually the second biggest canal feeder in the country. Someone told me that, I didn't know that. I'll have to find out what the biggest is, but I didn't realise it's the second biggest. Anyway, I've had about a two mile walk. I've been at it about an hour and a half. Uh, it's, it's a lovely day. God, it rained yesterday. It, it started about 10 o'clock and it rained right through till this morning. It was absolutely awful. So the fields are nice and sludgy. So I'll turn the camera around and show you these spectacular views. There we go, he's there. It isn't much, is it? But it was built to feed the Calden the Trenton Mersey Canal. I say it comes all the way from Rudyard, I've just walked it. Uh, I've got my, my new train is all sludged up. <laughs> I should have known better. But it doesn't look much. But like I say, it's a fair flow on it like this all the way from Rudyard. We're just approaching the top canal now where it feeds. I'm almost certain the top canal was constructed to get the feed from the Rudyard. Uh, you can't bring boats all the way down here. It's a lovely place, be lovely in summer. And there we go. That's where all the, my, all the water goes to. That goes, the top canal goes for a couple of miles and it joins Hazelhurst Junction where the, the main cauldron goes. So it feeds down, then the main one goes to Froggall. They've always said they wanted to carry on to leak with this canal. It's one of them jobs and lever out to be very nice, but it was obviously built just to pick up the feed from Rudyard. There's a map of everything. I say it's absolutely marvellous how they built these canals. And I say it isn't just a matter of the canal, you've got to feed it as well, the water. And there's, I'm almost certain that's a river churn it. That's flowing fast. I'm saying this is the canal. <coughs> if you go about half a mile, there's a tunnel. And just aside the tunnel, I think there's only a winding hole for a 40 foot boat. So you can't really go through the tunnel, which is a shame, really. But it's, it's a lovely place. And there it is. All the way from Rudyard. Constructed to take water through all these canals. When the cold and shut, what they do is you go to Hazelhurst Junction, there's a lock that carries on down. You, they lock that up so you can't go down it. Then the feet, the, the water goes straight down to the Trenton Mersey. So uh, they do that quite often when there's a water shortage. And they've had a fair shortage this, this year, as we all know. I think we're making up for it now. All the leaves have come down now, so it's absolutely spectacular. It's a shame boats can't come down here. <coughs> Still. Alright. I'll have a walk up there next time and go up to the tunnel. Oh, that's the actual end of the Calden Canal top branch. It's absolutely a lovely canal. Let's say it's about two miles long. There's no locks and the, the scenery is spectacular. <coughs> then there's, a, like I say, that there's a tunnel. Uh, boats over, I think it's 45 foot, can't go through the tunnel because the winding hill isn't big enough. So uh, I've got to get back down to the main road now, Ladridge. And head back to Rudyard to pick the car up. 
welcome to leak. I say it's a big pity they didn't uh, carry on with the canal to leak, but one of them things. Here's another plaque. Canal to all about leak. Lovely little town leak is. Don't tend to go very often now. So we'll just head back. It's nice. It's like, I'd say I'm almost certain this is a river chain. I'll have to uh, Google that when I get back. <laughs> so I hope you have a great, great day. And you keep subscribing and give me a thumbs up. And uh, let's get spring gear. <laughs> I say it's going dark that early now. Some trees down. A lovely bridge that is. In the middle of nowhere. So I hope you have a great, great day. And uh, I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.